Yoshi, shush. Hi everyone, I just got ready and I'm about to leave. I'm going to Bond Street, so I decided to vlog today. Actually, I'm not sure if I'll go to Bond Street. I might just pop into Harriet's because it's easy, everything's in one place. But I wanted to apologize, guys, for the lack of videos on my channel. And I just haven't been in the mood to film new videos. I really tried filming. I think I tried three or four times and it didn't work. I find it easier to vlog um, than do sit-down videos. Um, so I decided that I could probably vlog today. I'll be on my own and I'll quickly go into Louis Vuitton because I want to check out some bags and I'll try to vlog but as I said I'll be on my own so it's always a bit weird when I'm on my own. He's confused. <laughs> Um, so I'll show you my outfit before I leave. I'll put on my new boots from Louis Vuitton, which if you haven't seen, I bought a new pair of boots. Um, then my previous look, which I'll link down below, you can also see it. I think it's in this corner. Maybe this one. Wait, it's in this corner. <laughs> um, so yeah, they're actually quite hard to put on, guys. It takes me like 10 minutes to put them on. <laughs> but um, anyway, I will leave the camera somewhere so I can go grab my boots Whew. right I'll show you what I'm wearing in a bit hey hi alright these are the boots that I got from Louis Vuitton and they are so hard to put on i got them in size 38 and i feel that they're very true to size um so maybe i should have bought half size down because um my true size is 37 and a half but in like closed shoes sneakers and boots i always <sighs> i always buy <laughs> half size up um or even like a yeah usually like half size up but these, oh my god, they're so hard to put on. <sighs> Let me show you guys. Like, why is it so hard to put these on? If you have these boots, let me know how do you put them on? <laughs> like, it's so hard. <sighs> all right. All right, all right. They are very comfortable. However, I feel that they're a bit big. <laughs> So maybe I could have just bought my 37 and a half. Um, they're very true to size, so just get your normal size in these, I would say. Um, but I love them. They're such a neutral color and they really go well with everything. Oh my god, I'm out of breath. <laughs> All right. They look so cool. I love them. These are the boots. And now the other one. Let's see if this will be easier. <laughs> oh my god, come on. <sighs> it's slightly easier now because I'm wearing tights, but when I'm wearing socks, I literally spent 10, uh, ten minutes trying to put these on it is slightly easier with tights because they just slide in but yeah Whew. and uh, bam yay all right these are the boots i love them all right <sighs> let me show you my outfit quickly by the way, did you see this jacket? It's new and it's fluffy, but I'll show you it later because I'm already running late. All right, so this is my outfit. Everything, by the way, will be linked down below. Actually, let me increase the brightness. So I'm wearing this heart-shaped necklace. I'm not sure if I should wear this. This is my um, Dior Charica bracelet. A plain bodysuit and this skirt, which I'll link down below. It's from Zara and my new boots so yeah this is the outfit and i'm still not sure what jacket i'll be wearing but um probably probably okay let me pick up a jacket and i'll show you so i think i might wear this jacket 
I bought this jacket just for the boots. I actually bought this jacket before I got the boots because I knew I was gonna buy these boots and I thought this jacket will look really nice with the boots. So I got it from Zara, but I'm not sure if it's still available because it was on sale and I think the sale is finished now. This is the jacket and it goes really nicely with the boots, I think. So yeah, I think this will be my outfit and I also get my um, maybe Chanel bag, the Chanel jumper. Actually, before I leave, I wanted to show you something. I was going to show you it after I come back from Central, but I think it will be dark and I really want to show you it now because I can't wait. I got something from Dior the other day. So I got the new Blooming Bouquet. Uh, which is the it's not a new perfume, but I have a short clip actually, which I'll include probably here now All right guys, so I'm with Dior and I have promotion with sweets and I'm getting one of the women briquettes the new fragrances with the like um, Not a new but it's like with a roller bowl and they'll give me this um, Makeup bag which is really cute as well I'm gonna go for this sweet, I really want the pink one. Oh my god, look at the pink one! <laughs> I got the Blooming Bouquet, but this is like the roll-on. And this is like one of my favorite scents ever. It smells absolutely amazing. And they gave me something really, really cute, which I want to show you. Look! Well, they were not supposed to give me this, uh, so this is basically a free gift with any purchase of a fragrance that's more than 50 mil. But <laughs> this is like 20 mil because they annoy me. <laughs> they gave me this as well. They were so sweet. And it's this baby pink Dior bag and it has this cute little star. I have a few other things that I actually want to show you, like um, stuff that I recently bought, but I guess I might have to do that in a different video. Let's go, because I'm already sweating because I just put this jacket on and I'm really hot. So let's go to Central and hopefully I would be able to vlog on my own. <laughs> Street and I'll quickly pop into Gucci. I actually quite like the boutiques on Sloan Street because they're not that busy. It's quite busy in Harrods but not here, the boutiques are literally empty. I wanted to show you the window display because it's actually really cool. And uh, now quickly pop into Gucci because I'm looking for something I actually know what I want. So I'll quickly pop into Gucci and get it and then I'm off to Harrods. Actually I'll go to, that's the window display behind me. I'll show you it in a bit, but after Gucci, I'll actually, before I go to Harrods, I'll quickly pop into Louis Vuitton, which is across the street, there, where the bus is, basically. disappointing and now I'm next to Louis Vuitton and I'm gonna go in and check out some of the bags Thank you. 
yeah, this is definitely my favorite. So that's up to you. Only the reversed monogram comes with black here. Yeah? Look at that cab, it's Chanel. Chanel cab! Alright, so I'm on my way to Harrods and uh, I just popped into Louis Vuitton. By the way, the essay who served me, her name's Claudia. She was really, really sweet and helpful. And she showed me all the bags she could find because I have a few on my list. Most of them, unfortunately, are sold out. I really wanted to have a look at the what is it called? Bento box. She said that one sold out, I won't be able to find it. They did have the new round one. I don't know the name of it, but it's so cute, guys. Now I'm gonna go to Harris. They didn't have the pochette Matisse in monogram. I want to see that one. They said they can order it for me. I'll go have a look at um, Harris, see what they have there. And uh, then I'll decide if I want to order the pochette Matisse. And these are from the new collection as well.
so I'm back in Dior and they'll show me some ready to wear pieces from their spring collection because they're not out. I'll try on a jumper that I really like as well. got lost in Harrods <laughs> I couldn't find the escalator so I'm going back actually I'm going around in circles because I got lost but yeah I found the escalators now though I can see them look guys that's a beauty chocolate I don't know what it does I just picked up some chocolates from Godiva and they're so young guys, they're amazing. Gonna go to Starbucks quickly and grab a Starbucks because um, I'm really thirsty and I need coffee. And I also got some ladari, I got some food from the food hall. Look at Harrods, how beautiful is Harrods? Let me zoom in. Starbucks and I'll talk to you in a bit. Hiya. Hi. Can I have a warm, small warm latte? Warm latte? Warm. Warm latte? Yeah. <laughs> 25. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, so tired from shopping. I actually picked up a few other items that I want to show you. Um, so I'll show you them when I get home actually. I went to Chanel and I really wanted to buy pillow um, but they didn't have the color I wanted. They had it in a black and navy and I didn't really like those and they said they have one left from the color I want on Bond Street and I didn't really want to go all the way to Bond Street. Um, so I guess that one will wait but I really want to buy a pillow from Chanel. Guys look at the lights here, they're changing, they're so cool, it's like a tunnel. But look at the lights, wait, I'll turn around the camera. Feels like I'm walking. Feels like I'm walking into a club. <laughs> guys I ate all the chocolates I got from Godiva that's so bad because I got like probably 10 or 13 and I ate all of them okay so I quickly popped into Harvey Nichols guys I forgot the name to check if they have any Gucci but they don't they don't sell Gucci makeup and I'm just having a quick look at the Valentinos which are behind me Oh, <laughs> 
instructions. I'm going home now and I'll speak to you when I get home and I'll show you what I got. Just got home, wanted to show you what I picked up and also try on a few of the items that I got. Let me just leave the camera somewhere like on a stand, like my tripod, because um, it will be easier. Hold on. All right, let's see if this will work. Um, hopefully you would be able to see me. So I want to show you what I got. I got these earrings from Dior that I couldn't wait um, to wear. I put them on and I already started wearing them and I love them. I'm actually really happy that I didn't get the... Do you remember I was looking for the Jadio ones? Um, I will insert a picture because I can't, um, I don't know the name of them. I don't know if they have a name, but like the Jadio ones that are like quite like, um, they have crystals. I didn't end up getting them. I did find them at the end, but I didn't get them because they were a bit too much for every day. And uh, hold on. So I thought they won't be great for every day and I wanted something a bit more understated, not in your face, not so like sparkly and these are perfect, they are amazing and they actually match my, um, this bracelet like choker bracelet and my other chain one and I love them, I love the, I love the little crystal as well, they also come with a pink crystal as well probably gonna wear just one and then i'll put a different one on my other ear but even like these two together look really nice i don't know if you can see them because they're so tiny but they are amazing i'm really really happy so actually the earrings came in this they still have the christmas packaging i i think i threw away the oh no i saved it because i don't want to carry the little bag i literally have so many of these at home and i might actually throw them away it's going to the bin um all right so they came in this little pouch they still have the christmas packaging which is really weird well um i can't be complaining about christmas packaging can i i still upload <laughs> Christmas pictures on my Instagram Anyway, as I wasn't planning on buying anything today. I went to Harrods because I wanted to oh, Where is the lip liner? Oh, it's here. I thought I lost my lip liner. I bought a lip liner So basically I went to Harrods because I was um, I wanted to have a look at the Louis Vuitton bags and uh, I couldn't really pick a Louis Vuitton bag. I didn't really like anything. Um, the one that I really really like is the Petite Mal, and um, that one matches the boots perfectly. However, it is so tiny and it's so expensive. It's like almost four thousand pounds, which is insane. I can't really justify spending almost four k on a mini handbag from Louis Vuitton right now. Um, so I don't know what to do, like I really want a Louis Vuitton bag that has the monogram print and um, like a black leather detail. I don't want the beigey detail um, that most of the Louis Vuitton bags have. At first it gets dirty, second it, it doesn't really match my um, boots, like that detail. And um, the ones I showed you... In the beginning of the video, as I showed you a few bags that I was interested in, you can see there that all the bags that I showed you had the black leather detail with the monogram print. So that's like my favorite combination. And uh, I just love the look of the black leather um, with the monogram print together. Anyway, I couldn't find anything. There was one bag that I really, really liked. The I don't know the name of it. I'll insert the picture here. Um, that one was a runway bag from their runway like collection, or, like runway show, and they still had a few left. All the other ones that, that I was interested in were sold out, and they were like, you won't be able to find them because they were runway pieces. They're completely sold out, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> and I was like, okay, that's a bummer. And that was the only one that I found that I actually quite liked. However, the hardware was mixed like gold with silver. I really like the shape of the bag and I really like the style. So I'm considering that one maybe. 
I'm still not 100% sure and when I'm not 100% sure I don't know if you have any suggestions let me know most of the bags that I was interested in I didn't like some of the shoulder bags that like, like um, the what was that one called um, the victory victor victory bag or something like that the chains guys looked so cheap and so ugly and so gold like too like gold and uh, I didn't like them they felt very cheap because um, they weren't like heavy and like if you like if you have a Chanel bag the chains feel like very heavy and with the Louis Vuitton ones they just felt plasticky and like they didn't have any weight to them even with my Gucci bag and my uh, YSL bag that I got recently even like their chains are quite heavy and the, <laughs> the Louis Vuitton ones were like very disappointing like I had a look at a few bags like that victory bag and they showed me a few other ones and I really didn't like them the chains looked so cheap and like the styles weren't that great they looked good on pictures like when I saw them online but when I actually saw them in person I really didn't like them so yeah now like with Louis Vuitton I'm still considering the Pouchette Métis that one is sold out they said I would have to wait for like I don't know like four five months um to be honest I don't think I'll have to wait that long um, I think it will be a, a few weeks, like two, three weeks and they'll call me, I'm pretty sure. Maybe I should have ordered one because I think that one will go with my boots. But it, um, like the handle on it is not black leather, which is really annoying. And I can cover it with like a black scarf. Um, but I'm still I'm not 100% sure. Whew, okay, I think I've been talking for like, what, seven minutes now about Louis Vuitton bags. And... Um, I still haven't decided what bag I want, but if I don't find one uh, from Louis Vuitton, that's fine. I have other bags on my wish list, and my, to be honest, my uh, Chanel matches my boots, so that's fine. Um, but yeah, we'll see. I also wanted to show you what I got from Charlotte Tilbury. They have some new lip liners. So I picked this one, this is the Love Trap and I really want to try it on because I that was actually a spontaneous buy. I didn't really need any lip liners but I went there and I was like, oh I heard you have some new lipsticks and new lip liners, do you have them in stock, can I have a look? And they were like, yeah, yeah, we do have a few of them, we don't have the lipsticks but we have the lip liners. So I saw this one and I really liked it and I was like, yeah, I'll get it. I didn't even try it on so I want to do it now, that's why I bring... Um, makeup remover so I can try it on and you can see and we'll see if it's a good one and then I also got finally a um, pair of Huda Beauty lashes <laughs> and I got the Noel number 14 these are the four mink ones I actually want to get another pair I want to get the Scarlet or was it Giselle um, yeah, I think so. The girl who served me um, was wearing an amazing pair of eyelashes and I was like, oh my god, what eyelashes are you wearing? They look absolutely amazing. Are they Huda Beauty? And she was like, yeah. And she said she was wearing Noelle. So I was like, I'm gonna buy Noelle because they look amazing on you. <laughs> so I will actually put one on so you can see. And if you like them on me, um, I'll link them down below so you can buy them. I will definitely film favourites for January because um, I haven't filmed a favourites video for a while. Alright, I've been talking for how long? 11 minutes now. Great, Maria. I want to tell you about my Instagram. I have new highlights, which I will show you now. Alright, so if you go to my profile, alright, you can see some highlights here. So there is beauty, fashion, YouTube. Uh, favorites and what else website lifestyle so when you click to be or when you click on beauty you can see that's the look that I created uh, with this palette and then you can shop the palette so I will um, and then the foundation I'm wearing and all my like favorite new favorite uh, makeup products same with fashion you can shop my latest looks here on Instagram my videos as soon as I upload I post it on Instagram 
Also, if you liked my skirt, it is from Zara. Um, I can't remember if I mentioned it is from Zara. But I got so many compliments today about this skirt. Everyone was like, oh my god, girl, your skirt is amazing. Where is it from? And uh, I love it as well. So, um, make sure you check it out. It's from Zara. It was about £50. It's quite expensive, but it's amazing. So I'll try and link that. Can't wait to try the lashes. They looked amazing on the girl who served me. So I can't wait to try them. Meanwhile, let me remove that lipstick so I can try the lip liner. Multitasking hair. <laughs> All right. I've never ever tried Huda Beauty lashes. Oh wow. They look awesome. Can you guys see? Okay, this is not the best application. I can do it better, but I actually really like them. What do you guys think? Do you like them? So these are the lash lashes that I always wear for like every day. And these are the Huda Beauty ones. I think I have to blend them with some mascara. I'm happy. I definitely have to pick up more for the beauty lashes now. Let's try this lip liner. Bear in mind, my lips are very dry now because I've been wearing that liquid lipstick all day long. And it's really cold outside as well. Oh, I love it. It's like a nudie pink. Okay, this is not the best application, but um, I like it. I really didn't plan to buy anything today. I just wanted to have a look at the Louis Vuitton bags, but I'm really happy with my new earrings. I'm really happy with the lashes. They are awesome. I'll definitely wear them tomorrow. <laughs> and um, yeah, you have to see this in daylight because I think this one will look better in daylight. What do you guys think? Oh, I love this color. It's gorgeous. And the lashes and the earrings. All right, that's it. I'm gonna go sleep now because I'm really tired and I will see you in my next video. I really appreciate if you give this video a thumbs up and leave me a comment. I love reading your comments. Also come follow me on my other social media platforms which you can see here on the screen. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.